To make a waste entry, as with all credits, the first thing you'll do is click the Add button in the upper right hand corner. There's a couple of different ways you can make entries. First, you're going to select what the material is you're recycling, concrete, and then what did you do with it. If it's in its own dumpster on site, it is considered recycled source separated, so you'd simply select that option. You'd put in the total amount, we had five tons of concrete, and we recycled all of it. In this case, it's 100%, your diverted waste equals your total waste. Simply add each additional material, say we also had a wood dumpster, just simply select you had wood, it was recycled, there were two tons of it, and you recycled all of it. For your waste, same thing, if we have a waste dumpster on site, simply pick waste, that option went to the landfill, none of that is diverted, and put in the total quantity. If you have commingled recycling, meaning it's in one dumpster and they're simply saying you are at a certain percentage, simply add it as a waste, pick that it was commingled, material stream is commingled, percent uh, ADC or alternative daily cover, if they are using some of that for daily cover, put in what percent that is, otherwise you can leave it blank, and then just put in the total amount of waste that you had and how much of that was generated, and that will calculate your diversion percentage. Then simply put in the hauler, the date, and upload the waste report you got those values from, and you are good to go. Some commingled reports will give it to you by material. In that case, you are more than welcome to add it by material. So we had asphalt, commingled, recycled, again, put in your weights and diversions. If they are actually sorting that and weighing that per your load, you can consider that recycled source separated. So in that case, enter it by material, recycled source separated because they are separating it and weighing it for you. If you are just doing regular old commingled for everything, you will want to get some type of waste diversion letter from that facility letting you know how they're coming up with those waste totals and you should be good to go.